A major victory tonight for Word of Faith Church in Rutherford County. A judge found all four members not guilty of falsely imprisoning a former church member. The accuser says it was not a fair trial. News 13's Russ Bowen joins us with tonight's top story. Well, tonight both sides spoke to News 13 about the not guilty verdict and a damaging video that was presented in court. I think the trial went excellent. We are thrilled. We are thrilled to hear and see that these men were completely exonerated and the truth came out. Cameras weren't allowed inside for Friday's bench trial, but it was similar to this courtroom scene when Word of Faith church members were in court last November. Rutherford County church members faced this latest trial after being charged with stalking and falsely imprisoning Jerry Cooper in a local parking lot. Cooper was in town to support another former member who's accused church members of beating him because he's gay. The stalking charge from the parking lot incident was dropped early in the trial. And then defense attorneys went after Cooper's credibility with this video to find him not guilty of the other charges. Father God, we prophesy again, Lord God, that your fire and judgment would fall on this place until they bow their knee. The credibility of the state's main witness was obviously a key issue in this case, and that very clearly was a central factor in the judge's decision. I stand for what's right. I stand for justice. And I believe these people are a cult. And I believe they're false ministers. And as long as I'm serving the Lord and on God's side, I'll continue to expose false ministers. A special prosecutor and judge were brought in from outside Rutherford County, but Cooper believes he still didn't get a fair trial. Basically, it proved to me, and I hope it proves to the rest of this county, that nobody can get a fair trial in Rutherford County where Word of Faith Fellowship is involved. Follow me down here, we'll prophesy right in the middle of this crowd. You want to stir some stuff up? Let's do it. Defense attorneys brought up Cooper's past, claiming he has a history of irrational and aggressive behavior, referring to the video. Okay, there are institutions that can help you, Jerry. You should check yourself in. Why do you do this to people? Don't even do this, Carol. You're you need to prophet. check you know, yourself you're God. in. Full of Jezebel, out the stone in, in the public, prophets. disturbing people. A fair amount of evidence came out of the trial that this this gentleman has made numerous harassing and unwelcome contacts with the church. It's just the way they are. It's a mind game, and I will say this: as a minister, they may not get it in this life, but they will get what's coming to them in the next life. And an FBI agent did attend today's trial who is currently looking into the claims of abuse by a former member.